What's up, good people? It's Durable Brother Tove here, back at you with another one from Yatastic Gardening. Hey, be on the lookout for brew teas, okay? Brew teas, not beautiful beauties, but be on the lookout for that too, but brew tea, all right? T-E-A, all right? The teas, because we're about to launch the Herb of the Day show, and I want y'all to all to be prepared, have your pen and paper together so you can follow along. And you can know, but as you know, I we sell it here, so we're going to show you what's up. All right, what we're doing right now, every herb, every seed that bears fruit, all right, this is what we're doing today. I am collecting, these are zucchini leaves, and what I'm doing is collecting zucchini leaves and squash leaves have the same property, they're in the same family. So what we're doing today is collecting the leaves off. And it's a perfectly good way to go ahead and clip the leaves where you won't leave infection for your plant, okay? If I cut it up here at the top, just cutting the leaves off, it's just gonna die out. That tubular gonna die out on its own. It's not gonna be open. If I cut it in the middle, it's going to be open. Insects could get in there and infect it, okay? So let me read off first some of the benefits benefits of the squash and zucchini leaves, all right, so that y'all can be greatly informed. When you have a fever, it lowers the fever, okay? Um... It treats nausea and increased production of the hemoglobin in your blood. All right. It makes you look younger. So you can make a paste with it for a face mask. You can drink it in teas, whatever. It's going to do the same. You can work the outside and the inside. It prevents convulsion. So people that has that um, epilepsy and all of that, okay, this is what it helps with. Um it also improves your eye vision. Like carrots is known to improve your eye vision. So is this, okay? Controls diabetes. Treatment uh, for skin rash. You have, uh, you have certain skin diseases, right? Uh, uh, and, and you want to get rid of them. You make your pace or you also drink it. Hey, got one for you that a lot of people looking for that's trying to have babies. It, it helps your fertility, okay? Yes, it does. It helps your fertility. All right, and what about when you have that baby because it helps your fertility? Well, it helps your breastfeeding. It helps to improve everything in there, A, B, C, D, calcium, potassium, nitrate. Uh, uh, let's see what's some other one. Uh, um... Lindsay, Lutzen, Phenolanin, uh, Hypsin, Valine, Agrine, um, Folate, Water, uh, Niacin, Selenium, Magnesium, Copper, Zinc, fo um, Phosphorus, Magnesium, Iron, Calcium, A, B. See how much that do? All just off of this. Okay? It also helps to... Um, prevent bacterial infection, so it's antibacterial. Um, it helps with the, the clean the digestive system, like any other greens. It runs straight through you. Um, immune system and anemia. Okay, this, uh, uh, this is a powerful. So what we're doing right now, now that I read y'all also stuff, let me show y'all how to go ahead and clip it. Let me show y'all how to go ahead and clip it, cameraman. <laughs> All right. Okay, I want to clip them right here, right? I want to clip it right there. That's all I want, okay? Because I don't want to damage them. I don't want to damage them, okay? So I'm clipping it up top. I'm clipping them up top. And when I'm clipping them, what it's doing is it takes a lot to go ahead and 
get these leaves big. That's a lot of energy that the plant is working on. And as you can see, we have some, some zucchinis growing. So what we want to do is we want to go ahead and clip them all to stop the nutrients from going to the leaves. And then they're going to run back to the plant. All right, let's go to the next one over here. Because they're getting big, folks. Watch your finger. Clean anyone. Put it over here. All right. So we're going to continue to clip at the same area. Chop, chop. And what I'm going to do, just like you do greens. Now, if you look, look at the right here. See, there's no hole. I clipped them enough where I didn't leave a hole, right? And that's what I want. I don't want to leave it successful for uh, insect infection, right? So as you can see, I left that hole. You see that hole? So hopefully it'll close up real quick. I'm probably gonna have to go down there and chop it at the base, all right? But right now, this is where I wanna clip them at. Right there and no hole, all right? I'm getting all of these goodness. And watch the 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 uh the the what you call them? the fruit is gonna jump up now, okay? Because the power is going into the fruit. The power is going straight into the fruit. And when I get through. I'm going to clean them just like you do greens and uh, and they're going to wash them up and they're going to be good. And then I'm going to dry them out. And get him. All right. Get him out the way. Okay, I don't want him. Then we're gonna come over. Now I got a lot of them to do, so this actually is time consuming. So when y'all understand, folks, the herbal brother Tobe is trying to show y'all a lot of stuff. Okay. I'm trying to show y'all a lot of things to help you be able to heal your body. And uh I don't just hog the information because the scriptures say. Freely one receives, freely one gives. All right? But for my services, I'm going to charge. Okay? If you don't take my advice or... And it's not for everybody to know how to do it. But my services, I'm going to make sure I give you exactly what I studied on. Okay? So... I ain't stopping until I get a big one. This also, trimming these, gives me the fortitude to go ahead and be able to look for these little board worms so I can see good, okay? So I can see good. And that's what I want to do. I want to be able to see because they get real bushy. They're not going to stop growing these flowers. See all these tentacles? They're not going to stop growing them flowers. So I want to be able to see good down there. Right? I want to be able to see real good down there. Just like, let's take you back to the old days. If any of y'all did this in the old days. See, there's a lot of them. So I'm going to take my time. I'm going to crunch them, cut them off, and I'm pretty good at it, so I go quick, y'all, because I've been doing it for a minute. I don't touch none of the new ones, the new growth. I don't need to touch the new growth. The new growth is not what I want. Okay. The new growth is not what I want to touch. I want to get these so the sun can get to them. 
right? Son get to him, do his thing with him. Alright. And help it to grow. Help it to grow real good. Some of them that's truly gone. I want them gone. Them dark ones like this. I want them gone. I don't want no and when you're doing the garden, you gotta be on your stuff. You got to be on your stuff when you're doing the garden. They're your babies. So you got to protect them. So here, I got to lift my man up. Up. And I got to tighten. All right. Because I don't want to lean it down. I don't want to lean it down. So, both. That's what I wanted to show you for today so that you can have an understanding of already I got a big old bucket. Now I'm going to wash these and I'm going to let them dry outside in this beautiful Texas uh, sun. And I'm going to have another goodness for y'all. All right? For y'all to purchase. Remember, it's called brew cheese. You brew it like a... You brew it and make it into a tea. How? Gotcha. Hallelujah. Y'all have a good one.